What's going on, everybody? My name is Booster Bijou, and for the first time in a very long time, I finally found some stuff over at my local Walmart. So we're gonna be doing a Walmart haul video today. Let's do it. So I live in a much bigger city, and it's almost impossible to find stuff at the Walmarts, at least Pokemon-wise. Whenever you go in, it's either completely empty, they just don't restock it because people steal too much stuff, or they restock a very scarce amount and people are always checking and it just disappears. So I finally found a bunch of these Pokeball tins. I know some of them might have some evolving skies in there and then some of them probably will not. That's an E. We got E22s and we got some J21s. None of them are the Pokeball Go tins, so at least we know we don't have any of that. I was able to get what looked like a pretty old mix of like it looks kind of like it has the Vivid Voltage Pikachu on there and the Champion's Path Charizard. So I'm guessing we might get a little bit of both of those packs in here. I could be totally wrong. And then I found a Giratina Mini 10. Or I guess this is like the Medium 10. But I'm super excited because I almost never find stuff over at my Walmart. And it looks like I actually found some stuff that I haven't really seen before. At least not too much of. Uh, at least not or not in person so we're going to be jumping into this products and see if we can find anything cool i think we'll start with the giratina tin so let's do it here it is here we go giratina medium tin i don't want to say mini tin because i feel like mini tins are I feel like there's like three sizes of tins actually because you got like the mini tins that come with two packs you have like the vertical tins that come with uh usually four packs i believe and then you have the horizontal tin which i think right here comes with about five packs so let's get in here oh, flip that thing off we got a giratina v promo card super dope looking card centering looks really good and that's a good looking card and we got some lost origins lost origins and three brilliant stars so a little bit of a mix here i'm okay with that and we'll just jump into this we got some lost origins first up lost origins we've done a ton of lost origins there's actually one card i'm still personally hunting for in here which is the rainbow gudra which will complete all of the Gudra hits you can get from Lost Origins. Ducklet, Hisuian Growlithe, Shell Lost, Shuppet. I don't think I see it. I was literally about to say I don't see anything in here. And we pull the Gold Mew. Let's go. Gold View V Max card. Nice. We actually have this one already, but that's insane. That is dope. It feels like a little bit of a heavier card, too. I wonder if that's one of the series that people can easily weigh them and find if they got anything in the packs or not. Luckily, these are in tin, so we're good there. Okay, here we go. We got the Lost Origins, second one. Komala, Rhydon, Obama Snow, Porygon, Binacle, Shell Lost. Lost Origins has always been a really good set to us. Super, super pumped on that. Nothing in the second one. Here we go. Three Brilliant Stars packs. I don't think I've gotten any real big hits out of Brilliant Stars yet still. So let's see if we can turn the tides. Rhymer. Very... Bidoof, Electabuzz, a Reverse Haxorus, and a Hollow Bibarl. Brilliant Stars pack number two. Come on. All right. Energy, Pachirisu, Choice Belt, Luxio, Starly, Milsery, Carablast, Clefairy, Cherubi, Reverse Shinx, Electivire. One more pack of Brilliant Stars. Here we go. Even if we only get that gold Mew out of the Giratina tin, that's that's an awesome pull. 
Cafe Master, Nose Pass, Dadini, Cub Chew, Shinx, Far Fetched, Reverse Team Yell, and that's it. Yep, that's fine. We'll take it. We got a really sick Giratina promo card, and then we got an incredible the gold. Uh, was it like a gold lining new V Max? Super awesome. Okay, I think the second thing that we're going to do is we're going to jump into this uh, lunchbox. And I want to say, it kind of looks like I said it has the it has the Vivid Voltage Pikachu on there. Let's see if we can rip this thing open. The packs on the front don't say Vivid Voltage, but I feel like a lot of these... Jeez, that was loud. I feel like a lot of these tins and lunch boxes and Pokeballs and stuff seem to get restocked with different stuff that's actually on the packaging, so we're not going to worry about that too much. There's a little dent right there that we can pop out. Nice. Looks a little better. Okay, we'll open it up. We got three promos. We got the Sword and Shield starters. Oh my gosh, yo. I don't know if you can see this in the video. But every single one of our starter promos has a swirl on it. That's insane. So let's see if we can get a view of the Cinderace. Look right by his hand. He's got the Rasen gun, basically. There we go. You see a little swirl action right there. That's super cool. I think it's just one on there, but that's awesome. It looks like Inteleon. We got like a half swirl coming out from behind his little like flaps right there. You can see those very, the very close. There it is. Boom. Nice little swirl action. And then Rillaboom has a big swirl right by his head. Oh, right there, right by, right by the drumstick. What are the odds of that? And then we got a really cool Charizard coin that we can add to our collection. Yeah, good thing we didn't listen to the outside because it does not have the packs it was saying it would. We got two Evolving Skies, a Chilling Rain, and two Battle Styles. We got some stickers. Looks like stickers right here. More stickers. More, more stickers, more stickers, notebook for your stickers, and a pretty cool mini binder with the V Maxes or Gigantamaxes Maxes of Charizard and Pikachu. All right, we'll go in the order we pulled them out in. So we got our battle styles on top. I haven't really done a lot of battle styles either, but I'm excited to. We got an old code card in here, which makes me think that this stuff has been sitting for a while, but Battle Styles is also an older set, so that really, I don't know if that means anything. We'll see. Horsey with a little water fountain spit in the water. Mankey. Galarian Slowpoke. We got a Reverse Drampa and a Galarian Slowbro. We have another Battle Styles. More old code cards. Again, I really don't know if that's going to help us in this scenario, though. Swordwood and Shield Bit. Tone Edge, Mankey, Galarian Slowpoke, Fomantis, Remoraid, Reverse Tapabulu, and that's it. Nothing in our Battle Styles packs. We got our one Chilling Rain pack here. I don't think I've really ever gotten a hit out of Chilling Rain. It's also something I haven't opened too many of. Chilling Rain has a green code card in there. All right, Energy, Kakuna. Why did they make that Kakuna look so epic? Farfetch'd, Porygon, Heracross, Sobble, Inkay, Inkay, Reverse Agatha, and Gallade. Nothing in our one chilling rain. We got two evolving skies packs here. Maybe we can make something happen. 
Let's start with Rayquaza. One of my favorites. Uh, looks like a newer code card. Come on. Fingers crossed. Fingers crossed for Evolving Cries, Ursa Ring, Crystal Cave, Phoebus, Teddy Ursa, Dino. I was excited that we still got some stuff of Evolving Skies in here because I was hoping that we were going to get him in the Pokeballs. Nothing. But I was surprised to see that we got some inside of the lunchbox there, too. Here we go. We got a black border code card. What does that mean? Does that mean we got something here? Fingers crossed. Switching Cups, Tentacruel, Herdier, Hitmonchan, Hopip, Feebas, Teddy Ursa, another Dino, Tentacruel, and a regular Hollow Victini. Evolving Cry strikes again. Okay, here we go. I got a bunch of these different Pokeballs. Uh, I don't think they're different based on what they are, just based on the labels on the bottom of them. So I got a Luxury Ball, two Ultra Balls, a Great Ball, a Quick Ball, a Poke Ball, and a Premier Ball. Let's just cut all these things open right now and see if we can get inside. Okay, I'm back. And I'm pretty sure that regardless of what our numbers were on the bottom of all of those packs, every single one of them came stacked like the Costco tins, which means we have a Brilliant Stars, an Evolving Skies, and a Fusion Strike in every single one of those Pokeballs. So let's separate them up. So seven Pokeballs, seven packs of each, Brilliant Stars, Evolving Skies, and Fusion Strikes all right here. I think we'll go kind of, we'll go like this. Evolving last, because we want to save the tiers for last, Fusion Strikes, and we'll start with our Brilliant Stars and get it going like that. So let's jump into it. Seven Walmart Pokeballs sitting on the shelf. Do they have any goodies for us? Energy, Torkoal, Roseanne's Backup, Probopass, Impidimp, Magmar, Riolu. I was honestly really excited to be able to find all this stuff sitting on the Walmart shelf. When you're in a big city, it's hard to, to find times when a <clears throat> Walmart is actually in stock. A lot of the Walmarts near me don't even pick up Pokemon cards anymore, at least not frequently, because they say that people just come in and steal them every single time, which is a shame, so it makes it really hard to find those Evolving Skies ETBs that everyone's talking about popping back up in Walmarts and stuff. About two weeks ago, I found the remnants of two Evolving Skies on the back of the card shelf at a Walmart, and it was already ripped and torn open, and I was so bummed. Maybe if I got there a little bit earlier that day, we wouldn't have been able to get an Evolving Skies ETB. Brilliant Stars, three packs in, nothing yet. Come on, Pokeballs. Uh, I had like three different codes on the bottom, bottom of all of my Pokeballs, and they all had the same thing. So I wonder if that at least implies like the print run that they maybe came from. Here we go. Brilliant stars. Simiseer V. Oh, that's not. That's okay. That's our first hit. We do have this already. Not a super great V card in my opinion, but we'll take it as the first hit for the video. Come on, brilliant stars. We need to get some stuff early on because I'm scared that with what we're pulling later not gonna hit anything with those packs let's not make it a dry video let's get something we've had pretty good luck lately I had a dry streak a little bit after 151 but now we're getting some hits again Garchomp just not 
in this video. Come on. Come on, let's get some. Let's go. Give me, oh. Like sometimes my neck and shoulders get stiff sitting here in the position that I am pulling these cards. Give me something. Give me some, another reverse Dredagon. Nope. We got the Trainer Gallery Dredagon in the last video. Black Border Code. Maybe that means at least a regular hollow in here. On brilliant stars we got this and one more pack cards are sliding so easy yep just a regular hollow last pack of brilliant stars brilliantly shaming me we got a black code which means we got a regular hollow in the back that though come on gabite halucha weasel gibble trap inch execute finally let's go let's go we got something from astral radiance on our last pack trainer gallery looks like gary with his vaporeon nice really good looking card there and a hollow guard chomp they still hit us with a hollow all right, we are two for seven on our Brilliant Stars. We're now gonna jump into Fusion Strikes. Fingers crossed, let's get a Mew. Let's get the Gengar. Let's get a big hit. I haven't actually gone enough into this set to know uh, what my specific chases would be, but. Oh, Sligu. Love a little Sligu. Oh, and a Gumi. That's a pack made for me. Let's take those. Aracuda. Snubble. Geodude. Sizzlepeed. Reverse Zorark. Why don't we put our little guys down in the bottom corner there? Whenever the Sligus and the Gumis are watching over us, we get the hits, so... I'm gonna put them down there, and we're gonna cross our fingers and hope for the best. Come on, guys. What's hiding in these packs? Frost Moth, Simiseer. Oh, I really actually like the artwork on that Simiseer. That's cool. Very, uh, very vibrant colors. I'll set it to the side. Darumaka, Sizzlepeed, Stuffle, Sandy Gast, Plusle. Look at these Plusles like Naruto and Sasuke on the water about to fight, standing on some lily pads. He's about to hit him with the Chidori, I swear. Look at him. Reverse Skarmory. And... Oh, it was stuck. We got something. Inteleon VMAX. Let's go. We got a Fusion Strike VMAX hit. Nice. Look at him. He's sitting up there on the tail in the sniper position. Sick. That's, that's going to be the regular VMAX, though, because you can tell it's part of the, the set with the numbers there. So not a super rare, but we're going to take that because Fusion Strikes is a deadly set. And it hit us with something. I'm going to keep that Plusle card to paint. All right, we got a hit out of Fusion Strikes. Let's leave right there. You can see it. Little Megumi and Sligu buddies on the bottom. Told you, they look out for us. Let's go. Let's keep moving. We got our energy. Darm Darmanitan. I don't know why I struggled on that so hard. Sligu! We'll put Sligu down there. I'll fix a spot for you, buddy. Flawitzer. Skarmory. Jinx. Mantine. Grubbin. Rotom. Absol. And the Gudra. Let's go. It's not sick. It's not super rare, but within a couple packs of fusion strikes, we just pulled the whole Sligu line, Gumi line, 
and all of those arts look really good together. I'm actually super pumped on that. That's a cool little personal achievement. Gotta go for stuff that makes you happy. Let's go, more fusion strikes. Spongy Gloves, Frost Moth, Simiseer again, really cool card. Toxel, Fusion Strikes has some really good arts. I'm liking this, like the Totodile, that's dope too. Veneery, Clababus, a Skitty, and Eveltal. All right, three more packs of Fusion Strikes. I know you got some good stuff in there, Fusion Strikes. Come on. Give the people what they want. Beware, Skaters, Low Pony, Cuff Fan, Impidimp, Snom, Onyx, Jigglypuff, Gligar, nothing. It is undeniable that some of these uh, some of these sword and shield sets are brutal on the pull rates. Paldea actually also hasn't been treating that well, and Paldea is a, a current set. And we're still just not getting the hits we want from there. Cute little Zigzagoon, Mankey, Launcher, Growly, Sim Reverse Simisir, and we got a V. Abominable V. Let's go. We got another hit from Fusion. Final pack of Fusion Strikes. We got two hits from Fusion, two hits from Brilliant. Let's see if we can get one more Fusion Strikes hit. Aracuda, Snubble, Geodude, Sizzlepeed, Reverse, Electros, and that's it. All right, Fusion Strikes. Brilliant stars, two hits each. Let's grab the tissues as we jump into Evolving Cries. Here we go. I wouldn't be surprised if we didn't get any hits from these. But we're gonna cross our fingers and we're gonna hope we pull something anyways. Pyroar, Flaffy, Rabombi. Maybe I should just enjoy these basic arts more because we're not going to get anything. Low Tad, Rufflet. No, we got to be positive. We got to get some. Hollow Raichu. Daruladon pack. Don't let me down, Daruladon. We got Black Borders. That means we have a chance, I believe. I believe that means we have a chance at something. We can get Evolving Skies hits. Come on. We can do it. We can do it. Pikachu. Tana cool. Some of the cards sticking together there. I think I see something on the bottom there. I think we got an Evolving Skies hit. That might be our first one, Hitmonchan. We got a reverse full face guard. Oh, I think I see texture. We got a hit. We got an Evolving Skies hit, and it's going to be my first one ever. Let's go. Three, two, one. We got a gold card from Evolving Skies. Oh my goodness. It's not a Pokemon, but we got a stadium card. Turf Field Stadium. That's a gold hit from Evolving Skies. That's still going to be a dub. That's two gold cards in this one video, I think. We got the gold VMAX, Mew, and now we got a gold stadium from Evolving Skies. Let's go. Oh, man. We pulled something from a Pokeball. Let's go. We'll keep that over here. Gold card. We still got five more packs of Evolving Skies. All right, here we go. Keep it going. Lantern. Pumpkaboo. Tentacool. Emolga. Lillipup. I can't complain now. Applin. I like Applin. We'll keep that. Pyroar and a Flapple. The Applin line is actually another really good line that I enjoy. I'll put them down there. For 
Apple Static, Aesthetic, that didn't work. Alright, we got a Sylveon pack. White code cards. I don't think that means there's going to be anything in here. Let's just keep going. Nuzleaf, Ice Q, Skip Bloom, Wobbuffet, Love Disc, Dwebble, Hippopotas, Zorua. These cards are real smooth. They're just sliding together. Nothing there. Three more packs, Evolving Skies. <sighs> Man, the luck has really just been hitting lately. We got a black border. I think that means that there's at least a minimum of a hollow in here. Let's go. Toy Catcher, Cryogonal, Ted Ursa, Low Tad, Lit Leo, Lit Leo, Bag on. We got something else. We got a, I think it's a black border, so this is gonna be a V. Evolving Skies V. We got. We got an Umbreon VMAX! Oh my gosh. Oh, it could have been. It's not the Moonbreon, but we got the Umbreon VMAX right here. This is just the standard VMAX that goes with part of the set. So it's not, um, it's not the alt art and it's not the full. No, yeah, that's it. So it's not the alt art. It is a full. Full art, I believe. I think all the V's and V Maxes are technically. But we got two hits out of Evolving Skies Pokeballs, guys. There you go, the Walmart packs. The Walmart Evolving Skies has hits inside. Now, if only I could get my hands on an ETB, because these Pokeballs were not on clearance or anything. We got another black border. Come on. Hopefully, not just a hollow. The evolving. <laughs> it's about to be evolving cries, tears of joy right now because we're just getting insane hits right now. I like that Swablu a lot. We'll keep that maybe for painting. Flabebe, Roggenrola, Bergamite. We got a Nicket. We're getting a bunch of black border cards. We got Milotic. We got a silver border. We got a silver border. We got another hit from Evolving Skies. Let's go. Three two one we got a full art trainer let's get it copycat oh my gosh look at that he's dressing up as all of the sword and shield characters that's hilarious that's a dope looking look at the the leon stance in the background that's hilarious nice a full art I'm not gonna complain. I'm not gonna complain about any of this because Evolving Skies is such a difficult set and we got three hits out of Evolving Skies just now. Okay, last pack of Evolving Skies. If you guys made it through the video this far, I super appreciate you watching because it's not a, oh, we got another black border. That means there might be something else in here. Oh my goodness. Fingers crossed, it's not just a regular hollow. What was I saying? I appreciate it if you guys watched this entire video. I know this is a little bit longer. I never find good stuff at my Walmart, but this is, I guess, just <clears throat> the key to say that you just got to keep checking. You got to check every now and then. Try to figure out when your Walmart stocks up and just try to keep an eye out and look for those, look for those old products. You never know what you're going to get. Please hit that like button if you guys enjoyed this and you thought we got some good hits. Drop a comment below on what you think that our best hit of the day was because we definitely opened up a lot of packs. We got some good stuff. I like how the Evolving Skies set is so much centered around Eevee and the Rayquaza and they have a card with both of them in there and it's just a basic card. Oh subscribe so you guys don't miss any more pokemon tcg content i'll be getting a lot more comfortable with my editing software so i feel like i'm gonna get back to doing multiple multiple youtube videos a week hopefully we can stick to like an every other day schedule that would be awesome and i'm doing a lot of different stuff on my instagram right now where we're doing uh 
I'm doing a custom booster box where I'm throwing a bunch of random packs that I'm getting uh, and throwing them into an empty booster box until we have 36 and we're going to open it up here on the channel. I just hit 200 followers on uh, Instagram, so we're going to be doing a Instagram giveaway. So make sure you hop over to my Instagram. I'll leave links over in the, in the bio or the comments below, in the description below. And... We're doing daily packs of 151 over on my Instagram also, so make sure you guys go over there and check that out. We got just a yellow border, so it's just going to be a hollow, another hollow Victini. All right, we cannot complain. That was an amazing video. We got a ton of hits. Look at the table, all from one big Walmart haul. We got some really good trainer galleries. We got a couple VMAXs. We got three things from Evolving Skies and one of them was a gold card, which is just super amazing. We got an Umbreon VMAX, and hopefully that Umbreon's trying to tell us of things to come, and we got a full art trainer from there, and we got the whole, we got the whole uh, Gudra line over on the bottom, so I'm super hyped. Thank you guys so much for watching. I appreciate you, and I will catch you in the next video.